seem primary. It may seem like not very much, uh, but you will not, I will not, we will not go one place uh, until we get God, until we get the Holy... We can't go any further until we recognize Him. It's the same old gospel that was poured out 2,000 years ago. The love of Jesus that took Him to the cross. The blood that was shed that separated me from everything else. Glory to God. It never gets old. Hallelujah. He established all my goings. How wonderful. What a miracle. Amen. You talk about cancers falling off. I was helpless. You talk about blinded eyes being gone. He did that. He still does that. But I could not establish myself. I was lost without him. Now he stars. Praise God. Amen. There's not another star. And if there is, please get rid of it. He should be the star. Amen. He is the star. Amen. He is the bright and morning star. Hallelujah. When that little baby was born in Bethlehem so long ago, and that bright shining star that led them to him, there was no way it could outshine that little baby that was lying there in swaddling clothes in a manger. The Savior of the world was shining. The light had come into the world. It outshines everything. Glory to God. Amen. There's nothing as bright as it shines in the world. There's nothing that shines as bright as he does. Glory to God. Amen. For a man to come from heaven, knowing then that Calvary, oh, what love beyond all measure, that he gave his life for me. Look at the second verse. Amen. Thank you, Lord. From the lofty courts of heaven came a bud on earth to bloom, knowing when he left the throne that his fate would be the tomb. Oh, my God, hallelujah. There was victory. There was power. There was no defeat from the time he stepped from eternity and into my time when he came from the third heaven from where he occupied that space with his father, there was no defeat. From that moment, it was victory. It was power. It was love. It was everything that humanity needed. Lost man would be saved. Praise the Lord. We can, we're saved tonight. There's power tonight. Because of him. Amen. Then it said, but the grave. Oh, yes, he knew all that. But there was victory over it. There was power over it. There was nothing that could hold him. Can I tell you tonight? There is nothing that could hold him tonight. Oh, my God. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. But the grave could not hold him. My God. Angels. 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 He was lying there dead. Come on, brother. Somebody sent angels. Somebody. My Lord. How did those angels get there? When he left heaven, did he leave it vacant? No. My God. No, he did not. Oh, his father. Who had declared neither mother nor father nor anything he always was, could not lie, could not die. The ancient of age was still there with the angels. And at the right time, that grave opened up, that stone rolled back, and those angels sat there. And they waited. They waited for those sisters to come. They waited 
here. They, they, oh, they knew they were God. They, they knew what they were. And, and they were already in favor, messengers of God. They had a, they had a message. My Lord, they, they, were, they had something in store for them. They thought they had lost him. My God, could you imagine what it would be like, uh, really, to lose Jesus? And really not have him. Really not have him with you every day. Amen. Not have him do what he does for you. Even when you don't know he's doing it. How God can take a person and lift him out of the grave that they're in. How he can take a stone that's behind, that they're behind, that can, cannot overcome. How he can move a mountain. Praise God. How he can put angels there. My God, to sit on that stone. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. The angels rolled the stone away. Amen. When they looked inside, he wasn't there. And they just asked a simple question. Amen. Why seek you? Why seek you? How can you look for the living among the dead? He's not here. You're looking for Jesus. Come on. They thought they had killed him. Boy, was there ever a stir. Somebody stole him. They moved a stone. They've taken him. We don't know where he is. The angels were there trying to tell him he's not here. But he's risen. Glory to God. Amen. There was the same power that Paul said that I may know him. And here it is for you and I. Amen. It didn't stop there. It's still real 2,000 years later. It's still powerful. It's still the same. We still have access to it. We can reach him tonight. Believe it. It's not a story. He's real. He's not fake. He's not religion. He's not a program. But he's real tonight. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Come on, Brother Luther. Praise God. Thank you, Sister Brenda. Come on. God bless you. Hallelujah. Paul said that I may know him. Amen. In the third chapter of Philippians, it's in your Bible. You can read it there. Amen. I believe that he experienced it for himself. He said that I may know him. Amen. And the power of his resurrection. Amen. Glory to God. The same power that moved him. Amen. From what he was before to what he was after he come out of that grave. Amen. Yes. Amen. Glory to God. And the fellowship of his suffering. Lord of us. Praise God. May he make him full Thank you, Lord. Amen. Thank you, Lord. Amen. How many love the Lord? Amen. How many love this gospel? Amen. How many love this way? Praise the Lord. How many want to make it tonight? How many believe he's real? Praise God. Amen. He can really do. And he really will do what he said he would do. Praise God. I love him tonight. I appreciate him. Let's praise him. Let's lift his name tonight. Amen. God bless you. Praise God. You know, tonight, since 1985, tonight, or today, was the saddest day in my life. Hallelujah. But I want to give God the glory. Because on that day, I lost my only son. And I went to a friend and I said to her, oh my. I said, I don't think I'll ever be able to smile again. My, God. my heart was heavy. 
And I tell you, when you are in denial, when you're hurt, now for mothers who have lost a child, and an only child, but I thank God for Jesus. I say I thank God for Jesus, because he was dead. And you know, when you bury your son, and you come home in the evening, and you stand at the door, or at the window, looking for him to come home. Yeah. Yet I know I just buried him. My God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. My God. And my heart was heavy, but I had to continue come on. because God had called me to minister the gospel. Yes. You know, I sowed in tears, my Lord. but one day I was reaping in joy. Yes. 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 Come on. Thank you, Lord. I remember going to the, my son was born on a Christmas Eve. Yeah. And this, he was that he died one day before my birthday. Tomorrow is my birthday. And uh, on the 24th of December was his birthday. So another pastor friend of mine, we went to the grave site. And I was standing there with my flowers. And I was laying the flowers on the tomb. And I began to cry. And I heard a voice from heaven. Yes. In my son's voice, he said, Mama, why are you crying? You know I'm with Jesus. And I said, let's go. I didn't, she didn't even know what I heard. I said, let's go. I had never been there again. I never been back to that gravesite again because he is not there. He is not there. Now, there's nothing wrong with anybody going to the grave. I'm not trying to say that's wrong. But I know I'm not going back. And you know, praise God, I was sad for a few years. I was wanting to sell my house. And I had a lady that was going to buy the house. I hate to go home. I hated to go home. Because of the pain that I was suffering. But I'm here to give God the glory. Praise God. The lady wanted to buy my house. She called and told my neighbor that she was ready to buy the house. The same day that she decided to buy the house, glory to God, I walked into my house, stepped over the threshold, and I said, God, what have you done? The pain and the agony was gone. It was gone forever. I'm smiling tonight. I am rejoicing tonight. Everybody was looking at me. Amen. And one of the, the, the uh, directors said, I've never seen a lady as strong as you, but he doesn't know who was holding me up. <laughs> Hallelujah. Yeah. And I said to my son, I will see you in heaven. Amen. And that song that they just sang, um, where Jesus, we didn't see him go up. Oh, that touched my heart. I tell you, praise God. And you know, God is a good God. And God is a God that will, you know, he showed me my son's death when he was 10 years old. So he, won't reveal, he will reveal things to his people. He will not allow you. But I'm thanking God because what I went through with, I didn't share it. I went on preaching. I preached and nobody knew the pain that I was suffering. But God, today, God. today I can say yes. that I am happy. Hallelujah. I am happy. What a Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Yes. To God be the Lord forever and ever. Praise Yes. Amen. 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 Oh, <coughs> the glory. 